We often hear our sun is a star. The stars are like our sun, just farther away. But how true is that? Are the stars we can see with just our eyes really like the sun? Which ones are really sun-like stars? Most of the naked eye stars that we see in the sky are giants, stars either in the last stages of life or just moving into retirement. They are all swollen up, some a few times the diameter of our sun, others up to hundreds of times the diameter of our sun. Only some of the stars we can see are healthy, stable stars called main sequence stars, still using primarily hydrogen for fuel. Our sun is one of these. These stars are in the main part of their life, not just being born, not in retirement. They're still working. These main sequence stars range from small, cool red stars through the yellow-white stars similar to our sun to the massive, hot, bluish stars. And for the most part, the healthy, stable main sequence stars we can see are the hot, bright, bluish stars. This activity can be presented as a PowerPoint, or you can do it directly under the night sky using these diagrams and pointing to the various stars. The PowerPoint file, called sunlikestars.ppt, introduces the categories of stars and roughly how many of each kind we find in our galaxy. It then shows what we can see with just our eyes. It takes you through Orion, the Summer Triangle, the Big Dipper, and Cassiopeia, showing what kinds of stars each of the brightest stars are, primarily giant stars and several hot blue stars. There are only three stars in the entire sky brighter than fourth magnitude that are really stars like our sun. Those are stars of spectral type G on the main sequence. And only two of these stars are visible from most of the United States. One is easily found in Cassiopeia. Look at the PowerPoint to find out where they are. Please read through the suggested script in detail. It's found in the PowerPoints folder on the Manual and Resources CD.